Okay, so now that a day has gone by for the event in Warframe, a lot of players don't seem to know where to get Omega Isotopes to build more blueprints to actually go into the mission again. And I get specific comments like this. I decided I'm going to make a video on how to get the Omega Isotopes the best way possible and the fastest way possible. So hey what's going on guys it's Sarge and today I'm going to show you the best place to actually get Omega Isotopes in Warframe for this event. So drop a like on the video if you enjoyed and let's get started. Now just a disclaimer before I start this video, this will only work for this one specifically because this Fomorian can change locations in different times of the event so the next time this event comes around it could be on a completely different planet. But to get Omega Isotopes you have to get Get it on the planet that the Fomorian is on so in this case it's on Saturn so the best place to actually farm would have to be Piscinas on Saturn. Now this is an infested survival mission that have some pretty average ranked enemies so they're not too hard to kill and in the case for PS4 I'm not sure if it goes for Xbox One or PC you do get a 20% drop rate increase for actual materials and resources and Omega Isotopes is an uncommon material such as Rubido so to get this item it's not too hard but it's not easy either. Now there are different ways that you can farm for it. You can use characters like Nidus who have really long survivability so you can spend a long time in there and gather as much as possible or you can go the route of Necros and use Desecrate to get as much as you can. Since Desecrate will increase the drop chances for materials, using Desecrate with a team can get you a lot of chances to get this material. So for a 10 minute run which I will show, I was able to get 10 without using a Necros and only using Nidus. So getting them is pretty easy you can get maybe one per minute if you're lucky and you'll start to get more and more as you do the mission anyway so the best missions to stay on would have to be survivals and excavations but there are no excavations on this planet so you won't be able to do it here however you will need cryotic which I will talk about in a different video at some point where how you can get cryotic in the best places so that'll be the video for today guys don't forget to like favorite and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video peace out